Well, it's Tuesday, baby. I hope y'all are doing fine. About to start raining here in the next few days. We're trying to get all the yard work done. Or my boys are, anyway. Anyway, uh, with all the news about the queen and her funeral and moving her here and there and everything, a lot of shit in the news there, but yeah, there's a little information squeezing through that we need to pay attention to. One of them is the Department of Justice shot out about 40 subpoenas. Are you shitting me? 40? That's a whole lot of people that the Department of Justice all of a sudden wants to talk to, baby. They also confiscated a couple of phones from a couple of Donnie's number one boys there uh, in the uh, in the attempt to, uh, I don't know, put forward uh, fake electors. That's what they're talking about here. And, uh, yeah, the, 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 the FBI and the DOJ is trying to stop the steal, I guess, baby. Yeah, that's exactly what it is. They're looking into the Donnie's attempt uh, with fake electors to, uh, you know, Steal the election, you know. We already heard uh, Maggie Hagerman yesterday talking about Donnie just said he just wasn't going to leave the White House. Are you shitting me? But there's more going on in the world. Today, the January 6th committee got together for the first time in a while, and they're discussing what they're going to do. So I imagine we're going to see a little uh, programming note here pretty soon about when they're going to start the committee back up. Benny Thompson says they've gotten a lot of information, baby. A lot of information. And he's, uh, he's concerned about some of the information, I guess, they found out about the Secret Service. Are you shitting me? Well, that don't make me feel all warm and fuzzy. But uh, we, we have to take into account what was going on. If Donnie was going to barricade himself in the damn White House, was any of the Secret Service going to help him? I, I like to think not. But uh, I don't know. We're going to find out as soon as the January 6th committee comes back online. But... We got more stuff to worry about. I know y'all have seen that video of Donnie getting in his airplane down there at Mar-a-Lago and stuffing the airplane full of a bunch of boxes and flying off to Bedminster up there. Coincidentally, right before the Saudi Arabian Golf Club had their little meeting up there, you know, I wonder what was in them boxes and if that was a, if that was meant to be. But now we have the Department of Justice asking the National Archives are you sure we got all the documents? Because there may still be... Are you shitting me? There may be still stuff missing. Are you shitting me, Donnie? Are you still trying to hide out some? Is that the boxes you took to Bedminster? Are they in Ibotta's coffin? I don't know. Inquiring minds want to know, I guess. But it seems it's something we, we need to be concerned about if he is still holding confidential and, and top-secret documents and shit like that. There's no reason for him to be playing this game. He just in it for the money, baby. Always remember the art of the deal. There's something in it for him, or he ain't into it, baby. But we have to curb that stuff throughout our government. You know, I just saw a story in the New York Times about the, and this is unrelated, but it shows we got problems in this country about how many congressmen and senators have made stock trades recently on uh, with information they have on, on committees that they sit on, insider information. Let's better go sell or buy some stocks here. Let's make a boatload of money. It just pissed me off. We should do better than that. We should make a law. We should pass a free... Oh, wait, who passes law? That's right, Congress. And they're not about to pass a law that says they can't go in there and rob the banks blind. But who gives a shit? Today's the last day of primaries. They got primaries in, uh, let me see, Rhode Island, Delaware, and New Hampshire. Uh, this will be the last of the primaries. Then we get to the uh, November election. Again... Take the time to make sure that you're registered, ready to vote, and be in this, baby. Be in it for the right reasons. We have to save this democracy because we're the only one, we are the only one left that can do it. Anyway, BDF meeting tonight, 6 p.m. Central Standard Time on YouTube, on Facebook. Y'all come by, drop by Discord, come join the conversation. We'll see y'all later.